Hello and welcome to FME's Pesto Shop Custom Checkout Fields Modules Features video. First, let's talk about the key features. You can add unlimited number of custom fields on any position at any checkout step. You can create conditional or dependable fields, we'll explain those to you later. You have the option to restrict checkout fields to specific products or to restrict them to specific customer groups. You have the option to show fields on order email, invoice PDF or delivery slips. Admins can view the fields on order details page and order grid. Works perfectly fine with one page checkout and is multi-store, multilingual supported and also GDPR compliant. First, let's start with showing you how the custom fields actually function at the front office demo we have provided at PrestaShop add-ons and on our official website. This is the checkout page, we have added this product over here and the fields you see below are actually custom fields. We provide some dummy information here. These are a few text fields. This is a select drop-down field. This is a multi-select field, another drop-down field, and there's this is radio field right over here. We provided information person over here, but once we click business, VAT required, another field appears. This is a dependable field. Information provided on this field will give access to this field. So if we put person over here, the field vanishes. Let's go to other checkout steps and explain to you how the other fields function. Now, once we proceed to this checkout page, we have added a few other fields. Let's show them to you. So we've added a checkbox field and another text field. Notice the red star over here. This means the values on this field are required. If you don't provide these values, you cannot proceed to the next steps. Let's just go to the next step. Next, let's share with you how you can add custom fields to the checkout pages from the back office demo we have provided. Just go to manage custom fields and you'll find a list of all the fields we have created for your convenience. You can add fields by clicking over here or here. You can also change the position of the fields. Once you change the position of the fields here, their position will change at the front office demo as well. Let's go down and edit a field to give you a better idea how it works. Let's go with that. Obviously, as we are editing a field, all the information will already be here, like the field name, like the field type, like the default value, the field validation, which checkout step will it appear on. We've selected a few categories over here. Any category selected over here, the products of that particular category will have access to this field. So the field will only appear when it is necessary. You can do the same with products. We've selected coffee mug over here and you can specify which customer groups will have access to this field. You can also make this field editable, which means once the order is completed, the customers can go to the account section and edit the information of this field. You can make the values required. You can show this field on customer account and admin order. You can enable the field status. You can make this field dependable, which we have done. So once you make the field eligible, you have access to these two fields, which is dependable field, dependable value. So we made it dependable on RUR and you made the value business VAT required. Now let's show you how admins can view all the custom field information their customers have provided at the back office orders page. Just click on orders and go to any order. Let's go with this one. Let's scroll down and we'll find all the information they have provided on the custom fields. Finally, here's how customers can view all their custom field information. They just have to go to their account page and go to order history and details. Here they will find the list of all their orders. Just click on details. If we scroll down, we'll find all the custom fields. They can edit any custom field that the admins have allowed to be editable.
Thank you so much for watching another one of our features video. If you have any questions, please leave a comment or find us on social media.